This 10 News Pinpoint Weather Report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. Leah joining us once again with all those details of lots of sunshine ahead. Oh yeah, certainly not feeling like January. How lucky are we? I have friends in other parts of the country who are posting about negative temperatures and uh, snow. Hey, we get sunshine and beautiful conditions. We do have some winds picking up. We have a wind advisory that's going to be kicking in on Saturday. Like I mentioned earlier, it's for our daytime hours for those uh, inland and mountain areas, but sunny and clear skies for the most part for the next week. We're actually not expecting any rain for the next week. So it's looking like January is going to end on a dry note. Our Ramona Sky camera right now looking like beautiful sunset. We have a little bit of pink on the horizon. Current temperatures mostly in the lower 60s. La Jolla at 57 degrees. Imperial Beach at 59 degrees. Julian 51 degrees currently. Uh, these temperatures are up to 5 degrees warmer than where we were at this time yesterday. So today you may have noticed the difference. Uh, it was a little bit warmer out there. And these above average temperatures are going to stick around for the next couple of days. So heading into tomorrow. Uh, temperatures will be right on track with seasonal norm for our coastal areas. So we're talking mid 60s as we push inland. We'll see some 70s on the map for tomorrow. Lower 70s in store, 50s and 60s in our mountains and mid 70s in store for our desert communities. It's going to be another beautiful day. So for our coastal areas, it'll be clear, sunny skies in uh, those afternoon hours. We'll spend most of the afternoon in those 60s. I was out at uh, Pacific Beach today. Absolutely beautiful. It's going to be beautiful yet again tomorrow. Inland areas, same thing. We're going to spend most of those afternoon hours in the 60s. Lows for tonight, so those early morning hours will be in the mid 40s. But clear skies, and these are going to stick around for the next couple of days. So, like I said, winds going to calm down a little bit tomorrow. They're going to be picking up for our daytime hours um, on Saturday. Highs for our coastal areas going to stay in those upper 60s for the, through the weekend. A little bit of a cool down as we head into early next week. So, we're going to be cooling down to the mid 60s early next week and then warming back up just in time for next weekend. But you see lots of sunshine on the board. Inland area is going to see lower 70s for the next couple of days with those windy conditions picking up Saturday. We could see gusts in the 40 to 50 mile per hour range, and then cooling down to the upper 60s as we head into early next week. In our mountains, temperature is going to be mostly in the 50s, a brief stint in the 40s uh, on Saturday with those windy conditions once again. And in our desert communities, same thing. Uh, mostly 70s for the next seven days. Uh, lows are going to be in the 40s for the next week as well, but lots of sunshine on the map and no rain, which I, I know we love the sunshine. It's, it's a double edged sword, but January looking like we're going to be ending the month below uh, where our rain totals should be well below. So we'll need February to bring some good storms to get us back to where we need to be. But any day that you can walk the beach is a good day. Were there a lot of people out there? Oh, yeah, it was beautiful. I saw slow-mo out there. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you, Leah.